Okay, we're rolling. Okay, Luch, keep it down, okay? Actually, no, okay, stand beside now. Okay. Okay, that's exactly what we don't want, Luch. What is it? What is it? What is it? Okay, everybody, it's September 4th. Uh, we're here uh, in Carlisle, Ontario um, at a spring, an old, old spring that we don't really know much about. Um, the location of the spring is on Green Spring Road and Progreston, and um, it's just down the street from um, Dutchman's Gold, which is uh, run by a lady named Anne. She's the one that told me about this uh, spring. She's been a beekeeper for 30 years, and uh, her family used to get her water here all the time. Um, anyways, uh, these are my two new buddies here. Um, I was actually at another spring up the road that's been closed down uh, because of a, whatever, a bridge was taken out and so they're doing some construction but uh, there's a really good old famous spring up the road that we'll, uh, we'll talk about later but anyways, I'm there with my little son Luciano checking it out and all of a sudden Natalie and Al show up <laughs> and we're talking in the middle of nowhere and Natalie starts talking about the best water ever and I knew immediately what she was uh, into and what she was all about. <laughs> anyway, just introduce you guys. Go ahead. Uh, I'm Natalie Humphrey. And I'm Alan Clark. Uh, Natalie was originally from Michigan, moved up to Guelph. Now she's back in Michigan. And Al is originally from... Edmonton. And now I'm in Brampton. Brampton. So anyways, uh, with, with this whole raw food thing, with this uh, spring water thing, you're always hearing the word synchronicity is happening. And uh, I'll tell you something, that was a major synchronicity happening up there. Uh, Natalie also actually makes uh, her own raw cacao bars, and uh, I'm just going through a couple uh, days of cacao withdrawal, and doesn't she come up with one just out of the blue? Uh, <laughs> one of the best ones I've ever tasted. <clears throat> Anyways, long story short, uh, we'll keep that at, at that, and uh, we'll talk about the spring a little bit. Like I said, we don't know much about it. Um, we ran into some locals and uh, some local kids, they've been drinking out of it all their lives and uh, they seem to be totally happy with it. The temperature was about 9.8. Um, I've been here a few times where it's been below 7, been closer to 6. Um, as far as this pipe, this pipe goes back down as far as I can see um, and then it goes into the ground, but it looks like it's coming straight from a hill, about, um, a hill that's about 12 feet high. And all I know all I know is back in the 80s, the spring was originally uh, condemned to uh, due to high nitrates, probably a lot of fertilizer and stuff in the areas. Um, but anyways, like I said, whatever happened in the 80s stays in the 80s. So uh, who knows? This thing could be completely uh, not necessarily the best water ever, or it could actually be the best water ever. I don't really know. I've never had it tested. I don't know of anybody that has it tested. If you're, if you're going to come down and uh, drink from it, I probably would recommend actually testing it just to be safe but um, a lot of this stuff a lot of times you go to these springs and you Look, go on Alan field just it. oh there you go Alan's he's alive, Alan's alive <laughs> and he's doing well but I mean a lot of this stuff is basically you go on feel and the water feels right um, I'm drinking it right now and uh, I'm sure a lot of people in this area are drinking it too so anyways that's about it if you know anything about the spring please feel free to post some comments um, we're going to enter all this information into uh, www.findaspring.com, a site that Daniel Vitalis and uh, a bunch of his buddies put together that's actually serving a lot of people very well. And uh, if you have any springs in your area, uh, please feel, fr feel free to share the, uh, the local info and uh, we'll take it from there. Anyways, take it easy, guys. Have the best day ever. Have the best day ever. <laughs> that was better. <laughs>